Hey, what's up, y'all? This is your boy, Master P. Dot. So the Philadelphia Eagles has officially fired head coach Doug Peterson. Now, um, I'm not surprised. Maybe just a little bit because I, I really didn't. I really didn't think they was gonna keep him. I really think they was gonna release him. I thought he was gonna keep him for at least one more year. But um, I'm okay with it. It, it. it has to happen. It was needed to happen for a reason. Because you've seen what happened in the last two seasons. It has been awful. It was bad. And um, I just want to say um, I appreciate for what he has done. Five years being the head coach of the Philadelphia Eagles. But it had to come to an end. They had to let them go. It must be heard. It must be said. Let's, let's get that clear. It, it was time for him to, like, to part ways from him. So um, we appreciate for what he has done, but it's that time to let you go. But um, the problem is that um, Howie Roseman is still around. I would um the Eagles to fire Howie Roseman before Doug Peterson. But it is what it is at the end of the day. But we don't know who's going to be the head coach. And um, we don't know who's going to be the next defensive coordinator. But we need a huge turnaround with this organization. Th this has to be rebuilt. And the new norm is dead. Bury it. Let's just, like, move past that. You couldn't live up to your word. You was thinking you know it all, th thinking uh, you didn't need an offensive coordinator, thinking you could play all the – uh, make all the plays for all the um, bad decisions you you have been making. They had to let you go. It had to happen. But we appreciate what you have done. You definitely going to be in the, um, the Philadelphia Eagles Hall of Fame for sure. Along with um Jim Schwartz, Frank Wright, and the rest of them. That was a part of that 2017 roster to help them win the first Super Bowl in franchise history. You can never take that away. But um we don't know what's gonna happen next. But the drama and the torment is not over. Let's not be fooled. <sighs> well they well they release some of the veteran players Y'all can keep some of them, keep keep most of them, keep certain veteran players around. Like um, I would keep Brandon Graham for at least one more year. I would keep Jason Kelsey around. I would keep um Lane Johnson. And um, I would keep um. Of course, uh, Fletcher Cox for uh, one more year. But um, we don't know what, what might happen with Carson Wentz because um, now Doug Peterson is gone. We don't know uh, if he might get traded or not. Whether he stay in Eagle or he's going to play with another team, you never know. But um, I'm still not satisfied. I mean, I kind of feel better for the moment. Now that Doug Peterson is gone, but um, I, I still have a difficult moment that Howie Roseman is still around because he is the main concern that we have when it comes to this organization. And um, until April comes, the NFL draft will come, and. I'm more worried of who he's going to pick because he had made some bad decisions on certain positions that we really didn't need. But I just don't know. Um, but will the next head coach and him 
get on the same page? Can they work together? Can they communicate? Can the next head coach communicate with the QBs in the offense? Can he do that? Will they help find a coordinator to help out this offense? Will uh, the next and new defensive coordinator help out this defense to help them rebuild? We're going to find out till the draft and next coming season. Or um, before the trade deadline. Whatever. But it's not over. Something else might happen. I'm just starting to um, see something right now. Something's going to happen. You never know what it's going to be. I don't know. I don't know who. I don't know what. I don't know when. But something else is going to happen. It's not over. It is not over. This is just the beginning. It's just getting started. So, um, tell me your thoughts about um, the Eagles on um, firing Doug Peterson. Are y'all glad? Are y'all mad? Just on a comment below. But if y'all like my content, comment uh, comment below, like the video, subscribe to my channel, and follow me on Instagram. And I'm out.